West Ham have recorded pre-tax profits of over £10 million and the joint chairman David Sullivan has said he is satisfied with the achievements the club have made. West Ham are sixth in the Premier League heading into the new year, only two points off a Champions League qualifying position. The club have also unveiled plans for their new Olympic Stadium home and agreed the sale of Upton Park. In a statement issued on their website West Ham announced their latest figures, with many showing an upturn in fortunes with Sullivan announcing over the weekend he is hoping he and co-owner David Gold can sell a 20% stake in the club. West Ham United are pleased to announce a record group profit before tax of £10.3 million following a successful 2013-14 for the club both on and off the pitch, the statement read. This is a significant improvement on last year's loss before tax of £3.5 million. As the team overcame a difficult start to the season to finish 13th in the Barclays Premier League, the club increased revenues to an all-time high. Turnover was up to £114.8 million compared to £89.8 million the previous year, helped by the new broadcast deal and an increase in most other income sources. The wage turnover ratio also decreased to 55.6% against 62.6% last year, the lowest ratio since this was first calculated 15 years ago. The turnover was up despite bringing in nine new faces in the summer seven of which were permanent transfers, and Sullivan said in the statement that the board want to continue the improvements. My board and I are satisfied with the achievements we have made in the 2013-14 season, he said. The highlights for us being retaining our Premier League status and reaching the semi-final of the Capital One Cup, signing an agreement to sell the ground in preparation for our move to the Olympic Stadium for the 2016-17 season and our fantastic support despite our many injuries and therefore subsequent challenging performances on the pitch.